Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I have my March Ipsy Glam Bag. I was just cleaning my house, went down to pick up the mail, saw this in there, and I basically turned the camera on and decided that I need to film it right away. So let's just get right into it. I don't wanna wait. Okay, so I'm gonna start with a little card for the month. So March 2018, the theme was Create, which kind of makes sense why the bag looks how it does then. Uh, it comes with two markers, a pink and blue marker. Um, are these for coloring in the actual Ipsy bag itself? I'm not sure. Maybe you're meant to actually color this in. I'm not really sure. I'm just going to get right into the makeup. Um, so the first thing we have here is a rosebomb.com skin itself. It, you really can't see but it says glossier or glossier. I don't really know how you would pronounce that in, that word in English. I think it's just like a lip gloss. Yeah, I dropped the lid on the ground so I can't close it, but um, it's interesting. It kind of smells like kindergarten, like paint maybe, um, and I've never heard of this brand before. Rosebomb.com or maybe the brand is this glossier. I'm not really sure but I will leave the link for it in the description. And if you wanna try it, you can try it. It's really cute. The bottle is really cute, but I've never heard of it before. So hopefully I find the lid for it so I can actually use it. The next thing I have in here is actually something that I have heard of before. It is the Tarte Sex Kitten Eyeliner. Let me show you the packaging. You cannot read it. Um, so what it is, is just a gel stick eyeliner. I think I've mentioned this in a couple videos before that I do not usually use these, but this is apparently one of the best ones that you can get. So I'll definitely give it a try before I completely veto using it because I've never purchased it myself because I don't normally use them. So having it given to me for free definitely means I will try it out. The next thing in this package is a contour cosmetics lip liner. The packaging for this is seriously adorable. It's rose gold and I love it. This is in the color number three stud. Let's pop it open. It is a nude, slightly peachy tone, which is the tone for a lot of the nude lipsticks that I own. So I really hope that this perfectly matches one of them. I really love lip liners, but I have a hard time finding one that perfectly matches my lipstick, so hopefully that one does match one of my lipsticks. I mean, it's bound to. I have a couple that are that shade. The next thing we have comes in a little tiny bubble wrap baggie, which is super cute. This is a Hikari Cosmetics Cream Pigment in the shade Shine. Let me get this open. All right, this is a super, super pretty gold color. I am absolutely obsessed with this. I have been really obsessed with it. gold lately. It's basically the only color I'm wearing. Also, holy crap that is pigmented. I barely pushed on it. I am super excited to try this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at this. Wow, this is incredible. Uh, it doesn't smell like anything. Definitely gonna try this. Hikari Cosmetics. I don't think I've ever heard of this brand either i absolutely love getting all new brands i really hope that you can see actually how pigmented this is wow it's a really um it's a cream pigment which you can really tell just by the texture and consistency of it but i really like it i'm excited to try it i wish i had had that this morning when i did the gold eye look that i have on right now definitely would have helped it pop next thing also comes in a little uh bubble wrap, forgot the word, packaging. So we have a City Colored Glow Duo one half cream, one half powder. It is a cream highlighter, powder highlighter. Let me pop this open and give it a swatch on my hand, if I can get it open. There we go, I'm gonna use a different finger that I used before. Uh, the cream one is really, really soft. Let's swatch that. Um, it's super pale you can just hardly see it right there but i definitely think it would be really pretty especially in the summer just for a really natural looking glow if you're not into an actual like highlighter glow like a lot of people i know are not into that so 
other side, I just swatched that right here. It's a really, really pretty like champagne pink color. It's really pretty. It went on super, super easy and the color is super strong. I definitely don't think I could get away with wearing that as an actual highlighter because it's really, really pigmented, but it would make a really pretty eyeshadow or even just, I guess if you wore just a little bit of it, it could make a really pretty highlighter just above a really pink blush. It would really make that pop. Okay, so somehow that was everything in my March Ipsy package. I'm pretty intrigued by it. Once again, it was basically all new products except for the Tarte one, I have heard of that, but the other ones I have, don't think I've ever heard of before, not even the brand, so I am super excited to try them out and let you guys know what I think. If you don't know what Ipsy is, it is a monthly subscription makeup package bag. So you submit a profile online and then every month they send you some new makeup, products. You can also get hair and fragrances. If you're interested in signing up for Ipsy for yourself, there will be a link in the description. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below for some other things you'd like to see on my channel. Follow me on Snapchat and Instagram at smileysocks22. Make sure you just subscribe to join the family and I will see you guys next time. Bye! It's like kindergarten, like in a bad way. I am so excited to use this.